going to a bike store and getting a $20 helmet, it's, it might be beyond what they're able to, to grasp at that point with mm -hmm. their families. It might just be something that, that they just can't mm -hmm. get it. So I'm hoping that uh, my wife is going to uh, deal with that aspect as far, far as getting the message out there. She's been amazing at uh, getting it on Facebook and out to email and, and her family is awesome. and, and uh, a lot of positive responses come in. We we're just thinking about just getting it from family and friends, and that message is kind of just yeah, from people's work. They're they're just going a little bit further with that message, and there's a lot of people that really just think it's a it's a great idea, and you know they think about their kids and how important it is for their children to have helmets, and then for them to understand that some kids don't, and there's a lot of people that are sent there. They really want to jump on board and, and help out. Do you have any idea of where, if you were to estimate how many kids don't have helmets? I guess it depends on their age. I'd probably say twenty percent. Really? Really? Just there was five kids in my classroom last year that didn't have them, mm -hmm. and that's you know the idea that even if they have them, they need to be reminded of the importance of using them every time they step on the bike.